Welcome to the Simpson Desert. The fourth largest desert in Australia, which spans across the states of Southern Australia, the Northern Territory, and Queensland. It is an unusually diverse arid ecosystem with over 400 vertebrate species recorded. This is seasonal flooding around Lake Eyre and the Coonji Lakes. These wetlands are essential breeding grounds for birds and fish. This is one half of the desert's unique and dynamic boom and bust cycle. The Simpson Desert is listed as vulnerable by the WWF, largely due to the threats from introduced predators such as foxes and cats. These introduced species can also have a massive impact not only to Australia's biodiversity, but also to Australia's economy, costing $720 million to fix per year. Prime Minister Turnbull, the economic costs associated with introduced species can be astronomically high, with feral cats alone costing the Australian government $146 million annually. These animals are responsible for endangering many native desert animals, such as the brush-tailed Malgara, the fawn-hopping mouse, and even the dingo. As the dingo's numbers decline, we have the potential of losing a weapon against these introduced species. This is why we want you to fund the Dingo Division. Pretty much we're starting the dingo division, uh, so this is our first member called Poppy and we've specially trained her to fight cats uh, and foxes as well as eat rabbits. <laughs> there was a huge problem in the Simpson Desert um, and there still is a huge problem with invasive species um, and they're the cause of many endangered species um, so we're really trying to put a stop to that and do something about it. So yeah, rabbits are a huge problem. Uh, for one, they eat all the food, so they're depleting the food source for other animals. They're really destructive in the environment as well, so they're tearing up all of that uh, nice environment that the other animals would otherwise be able to enjoy. So you're a farmer around here? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I own this land. Yeah, drive a lot of cattle. We've got some crops, crops around here. Must get difficult sometimes. Yeah, yeah, it does, mate, yeah. Drought, big problem. Rabbits, that's the other thing. Tearing up all the crops. Lose a lot of money. How do you, uh, how do you fix something like that? Um, mate, you can't, really. Um, we've tried, you know, everything. Um, I mean, they said some, uh, you know, folks from the University of New South Wales coming down, train up some dingoes, put them on the farm. Seems you know, like a good idea. Haven't heard anything better in a while. Poppy is trained to fight cats and rabbits as well. Oh, that was it. Poppy was trained to fight. Yeah, a lot of planes out here too. Yeah, that's uh, Steve O, yeah. Um, aerial irrigation and spraying of his crops. Um, I don't really like it. <laughs> 